Book 1, D, The Wonderful Adornments of the Leaders of the Worlds, continued, D. Furthermore, the direction spirit dwelling everywhere found the door of liberation of the power of universal salvation. The direction spirit ubiquitous light found the door of liberation perfecting the practice of mystic powers to edify all sentient beings. The direction spirit array of light beams found the door of liberation destroying all barriers of darkness and producing the great light of joy and happiness. The direction spirit traveling everywhere unhindered found the door of liberation appearing in all places without wasted effort. The direction forever ending confusion found the door of liberation revealing names and epithets of Buddha equal in number to all sentient beings, producing virtue and merit. The direction spirit roaming everywhere in pure space found the door of liberation continuously producing exquisite sound causing all who hear to be pleased. The direction spirit great sound of cloud banner found the door of liberation bringing rain everywhere, like a naga, causing sentient beings to rejoice. The direction spirit top knot and eyes undisturbed found the door of liberation of the independent power to show the doings of all sentient beings without discrimination. The direction spirit universally observing the doings of the worlds found the door of liberation examining the various actions of beings in all realms of existence. The direction spirit traveling everywhere watching found the door of liberation fulfilling all tasks and bringing happiness to all sentient beings. At that time the direction spirit dwelling everywhere, imbued with the power of the Buddha, looked over all the direction spirits and said in verse. The Buddha freely appears in the world. To teach all living beings. Showing the ways to truth, having them. Understand and enter putting them in a position to realize highest wisdom. His spiritual powers are as boundless as beings, displaying various forms according to their desires. And all who see are freed from suffering. This is ubiquitous light's power of liberation. Buddha, in the ocean of beings hindered by darkness, manifests the great light of the lamp of truth for them. That light shining everywhere, so none do not see, this is the liberation of light beam arrays. Commanding the various languages of all worlds, Buddha teaches so that all can understand, and the afflictions of his hearers disappear, this is the realization of traveling everywhere. As many names as there are in all worlds, Buddha names emerge in equal numbers. Causing all beings to be free from ignorance, this is the sphere of ending confusion. If any sentient beings come before the Buddha and hear the Buddha's sublime sound, they will all be greatly delighted, traveling throughout space understands this truth. The Buddha, in every single instant, everywhere showers the boundless rain of truth, causing all beings' afflictions to perish, this is known to Cloud Banner. The ocean of doings of all worlds the Buddha equally shows, causing all beings to be rid of delusion by actions, this is what undisturbed eyes understands. The stage of omniscience has no bounds, all the various mentalities of beings the Buddha perceives with complete clarity, this immense door the world observer enters. Buddha cultivated various practices in the past, completely fulfilling infinite transcendent ways, compassionately aiding all sentient beings. This is the liberation of universal traveler. Furthermore, the space spirit pure light shining all around found the door of liberation knowing the mentalities of sentient beings in all realms of existence. The space spirit traveling everywhere deeply and extensively found the door of liberation entering everywhere into the cosmos of reality. The space spirit producing auspicious wind found the door of liberation comprehending the physical forms of boundless objects. The space spirit abiding securely beyond obstruction found the door of liberation able to remove all beings' obstructions by delusions. Caused by actions. The space spirit broad steps and beautiful top knot found the door of liberation observing and contemplating the vast ocean of practical application. The space spirit unhindered light flames found the door of liberation of the light of great compassion rescuing all sentient beings from danger. The space spirit unobstructed conquering power found the door of liberation entering into the power of all virtues free from attachment. The space spirit spotless light found the door of liberation able to cause the minds of all beings to remove their veils and become pure. The space spirit deep and far-reaching sublime sound found the door of liberation of the light of 
knowledge seeing everywhere. The space spirit all-pervading light found the door of liberation manifesting everywhere without moving from its own place. At that time the space spirit pure light shining all around, imbued with the power of the Buddha, surveyed all the space spirits and spoke the following verses. The vast eye of the Buddha is pure and clear as space. Seeing all beings. With complete clarity. The great light of the Buddha body illumines the ten directions. Manifesting in every place. Traveling everywhere sees this way. The Buddha body is like space. Unborn, it clings to nothing. It is ungraspable and without inherent nature. This is seen by wind of good omen. The Buddha for countless eons, has expounded all holy paths, destroying barriers for all beings. Sphere of perfect light understands this. I observe the enlightenment practices accumulated by the Buddha in the past, all to make the world at peace. Beautiful top knot works in this sphere. The realms of all sentient beings whirl in the sea of birth and death. Buddha emits a pain-killing light. The unhindered spirit can see this. His treasury of pure virtues is a field of blessings for the world. Appropriately enlightening with knowledge. The spirit power understands this. Sentient beings are veiled by ignorance. Wandering on dangerous paths. The Buddha emanates light for them. Spotless light realizes this. Knowledge and wisdom have no bounds. Appearing in every land with light illumining the world. Sublime sound sees Buddha here. Buddha, to liberate beings, cultivates practices everywhere. This grandiose will universal manifestation can observe. Furthermore, the wind spirit unimpended light found the door of liberation entering into all the Buddha teachings in all worlds. The wind spirit everywhere manifesting courageous action found the door of liberation providing extensive offerings to all the Buddhas appearing in innumerable lands. The wind spirit wind striking cloud banner found the door of liberation eliminating the sickness of all sentient beings with a fragrant wind. The wind spirit arrays of pure light found the door of liberation producing roots of goodness in all sentient beings and causing them to pulverize the mountains of multiple barriers. The wind spirit power to dry up water found the door of liberation able to defeat boundless armies of malicious demons. The wind spirit great voice howling everywhere found the door of liberation annihilating the fears of all sentient beings. The wind spirit tree branch hanging top knot found the door of liberation of the ocean of powers of elucidation, entering into the real character of all things. The wind spirit going everywhere unimpeded found the door of liberation of the treasury of techniques to harmonize and civilize all sentient beings. The wind spirit various mansions found the door of liberation entering into still, serene meditative poise and destroying the extremely deep darkness of folly and ignorance. The wind spirit great light shining everywhere found the door of liberation of unhindered power to go along with all sentient beings. At that time the wind spirit unimpeded light imbued with the power of the Buddha, looked over all the wind spirits and said in verse. The teachings of all Buddhas are most profound, with unhindered means by which all may enter, appearing always in all worlds. Signless, formless, without image. Observe how the Buddha in the past gave offerings to endless Buddhas in a single instant. Such bold enlightenment practice everywhere manifesting can comprehend. Buddha saves the world inconceivably. None of his methods are used in vain. All cause action to be free from distress. This is the liberation of cloud banner. Beings have no blessings, they suffer many pains, with heavy veils and dense barriers always. Deluding them. Buddha makes them all attain liberation, this is known to pure light. The Buddha's vast mystic power conquers all armies of demons. All his methods of subduing healthy power is able to observe. Buddha emanates subtle sound from his pores which extends everywhere throughout the world causing all misery and fear to end, this is understood by howling everywhere. Buddha, in all oceans of lands, always preaches, over unthinkable eons. This wonderful elucidation power of Buddhahood, tree branch top knot can comprehend. 
Buddha's knowledge enters all avenues of means, completely free of hindrance therein. His realm is boundless and without any equal. This is the liberation of going everywhere. The Buddha's state is without bounds. By expedient means he shows it everywhere. Yet his body is tranquil and has no form. This is the liberation door of various mansions. The Buddha cultivated practices for oceans of eons and has completely fulfilled all powers and can respond to beings in accord with worldly norms, this is the view of shining everywhere. Furthermore, the fire spirit repository of flames of universal light found the door of liberation removing the darkness of all worlds. They Fire Spirit Banner of Universal Assembly of Light found the door of liberation able to end all sentient beings' delusions, wanderings, and pains of irritating afflictions. The Fire Spirit Great Light Shining Everywhere found the door of liberation of the treasury of great compassion with the immutable power of enriching. The Fire Spirit Top Knot of Inexhaustible Light found the door of liberation of light beams illuminating the boundless reaches of space. The fire spirit eyes of various flames found the door of liberation of silent, serene lights in various magnificent arrays. The fire spirit palace of wonders found the door of liberation observing the Buddha's spiritual powers. Appearing without bound. The fire spirit palaces in all directions like polar mountains found the door of liberation able to extinguish the blazing torments of all beings in all worlds. The Fire Spirit Sovereign of Awesome Light found the door of liberation able to freely enlighten all beings. The Fire Spirit Light shining in all directions found the door of liberation destroying forever all ignorant, attached opinions. The Fire Spirit Thunder and Lightning found the door of liberation of the great roar of power to fulfill all undertakings. At that time, the Fire Spirit Repository of Flames of Universal Light, imbued with power from the Buddha, looked over all the fire spirits and said in verse observe the buddha's power of energy for vast inconceivable millions of eons they have appeared in the world to help sentient beings causing all barriers of darkness to be destroyed sentient beings in their folly create various views their passions are like torrents like fires blazing the guide's techniques remove them all. Banner of Universal Assembly of Light Understands this. Blessings and virtues like space, unending. No bounds to them can ever be found, this is the Buddha's immutable power of compassion, light shining, realizing this, conceives great. Joy. I observe the Buddha's practices over the eons, without bound, thus manifesting spiritual powers, Palace of Wonders understands this. Practice perfected over billions of eons. Inconceivable, to which no one can find any bound or limit, Buddha expounds the real character of things. Causing joy, this is perceived by inexhaustible light. All the vast masses in the ten directions behold the Buddha present before them. The tranquil light clearly lighting the world. This subtle flames can comprehend. The sage appears in all worlds, sitting in all their palaces, reigning the boundless great teaching. This is the perspective of all directions. The Buddha's wisdom is most profound. Free in all ways, they appear in the world, able to clarify all genuine truths. Awesome light, realizing this, rejoices at heart. The folly of views is a dark veil. Beings, deluded, eternally wander. For them Buddha opens the gate of sublime teaching, illumining all quarters can understand this. The gate of Buddha's vows is vast, inconceivable. Their powers and transcendent ways are developed and purified. All appear in the world according to their ancient vows. This is what thunder and lightning understands. Furthermore, the water spirit ubiquitous cloud banner realized the door of liberation of compassion equally benefiting all beings. The water spirit cloud-like sound of the ocean tide found the door of liberation adorned with boundless truths. The water spirit beautiful round top knot found the door of liberation observing. Those who could be taught and dealing with them with appropriate techniques. 
the water spirit whirlpool of skills found the door of liberation everywhere expounding the most profound realm of the Buddhas. The water spirit's door of undefiled fragrance found the door of liberation everywhere manifesting pure, bright light. The water spirit virtue bridge light sound found the signless, essenceless door of liberation of the pure realm of truth. The water spirit freedom of contentment found the door of liberation of the inexhaustible ocean of great compassion. The water spirit good sound of pure joy found the door of liberation being a mine of great joy among the hosts of enlightening beings at sites of enlightenment. The water spirit everywhere manifesting awesome light found the door of liberation appearing everywhere by means of the unimpeded, immensely vast power of virtue. The water spirit roaring sound filling the sea found the door of liberation observing all sentient beings and producing infinite techniques for harmonizing and pacifying them. At that tune the water spirit ubiquitous cloud banner, imbued with power from the Buddha, looked over all the water spirits and said. Gates of pure compassion, as many as atoms in all lands. Together produce a single sublime feature of the Buddha. Other features also are each like this. Therefore beholders of Buddha never become jaded. When the Buddha cultivated practice in the past, he went to visit all of the Buddhas. Cultivating himself in various ways, never lacks. These methods cloud sound enters. The Buddha, in all ten directions, is still, unmoving, not coming or going. Yet teaches beings appropriately, causing them all to see. This is what Round Top Knot knows. The realm of the Buddha is boundless, immeasurable. All sentient beings cannot comprehend it. The preaching of his wondrous voice fills all directions, this is technique whirlpool's sphere. The light of the Buddha has no end, it fills the cosmos, inconceivably. Teaching, edifying, liberating beings, this pure fragrance watches and sees. The Buddha is pure as space, signless, formless, present everywhere. Yet causing all beings to see, this light of blessings well observes. Of old Buddha practiced great compassion. His mind is broad as all of life. Therefore he is like a cloud appearing in the world. This liberation contentment knows. All lands in the ten directions see the Buddha sitting on his seat becoming clearly enlightened with great realization, this is where joyful sound enters in. Buddha's sphere of action is free from hindrance, he goes to all lands in the ten directions, everywhere showing great mystic powers, manifesting awesome light has realized this. He cultivates boundless expedient practices, equal to the worlds of sentient beings, filling them all, the subtle action of his mystic power never ceasing, roaring sound filling the sea can enter this. Furthermore, the ocean spirit producing jewel light found the door of liberation impartially bestowing an ocean of blessings on all beings. The Ocean Spirit Unbreakable Diamond Banner found the door of liberation preserving the good roots of all sentient beings by skillful means. The Ocean Spirit Undefiled found the door of liberation able to evaporate the ocean of all sentient beings' afflictions. The Ocean Spirit Always Dwelling in the Waves found the door of liberation causing all sentient beings to depart from evil ways. The Ocean Spirit Auspicious Jewel Moon found the door of liberation everywhere destroying the darkness. Of great ignorance. The ocean spirit beautiful flower dragon top knot found the door of liberation extinguishing the sufferings of all states of being and bestowing peace and happiness. The ocean spirit everywhere holding the flavor of light found the door of liberation purifying all sentient beings of their opinionated, ignorant nature. The ocean spirit jewel flame flower light found the door of liberation producing the will of enlightenment which is the source of all nobility. The Ocean Spirit Beautiful Diamond Top Knot found the door of liberation of the ocean of virtues of the unshakable mind. The Ocean Spirit Thunder of the Ocean Tide found the door of liberation. Entering everywhere into absorption in the cosmos of reality. At that time, the Ocean Spirit producing jewel light, imbued with power from the Buddha, looked over all the Ocean Spirits and spoke these verses. Over an ocean of inconceivably vast eons. He made offerings to all the Buddhas. Distributing the merit to all living beings. That is why his dignity is beyond compare. 
appearing in all worlds. Knowing the capacities and desires of all beings, Buddha expounds for them the ocean of truths, this is joyfully realized by indestructible banner. All sentient beings are shrouded by afflictions, roaming in all conditions, subject to all miseries, for them he reveals the state of Buddhahood, palace in all waters enters this door. Buddha, in unthinkable oceans of eons, cultivated all practices endlessly, forever cutting the net of being's confusion. Jewel Moon can clearly enter this. Buddha sees beings always afraid, whirling in the ocean of birth and death, he shows them the Buddha's unexcelled way, dragon top knot, comprehending, gives rise to joy. The realm of the Buddhas cannot be conceived. It is equal to the cosmos and space. It can clear away beings' net of delusion. This flower holding is able to expound. The Buddha eye is pure and inconceivable. Comprehensively viewing all things. He points out to all the excellent paths. This flower light understands. The army of demons, huge, uncountable. He destroys in the space of an instant. His mind undisturbed, unfathomable. This is Diamond Top Knot's technique. Speaking a wondrous sound in the ten directions, that sound pervades the entire universe, such as the Buddha's meditation state, this is the realm of ocean tide thunder. Furthermore, the river spirit everywhere producing swift currents found the door of liberation everywhere reigning the boundless reign of truth. The river spirit universally purifying springs and streams found the door of liberation appearing before all sentient beings and causing them to be forever free from afflictions. The river spirit dust free pure eye found the door of liberation by compassion and appropriate techniques washing away the dust of delusions from all sentient beings. The river spirit roaring everywhere found the door of liberation constantly producing sounds beneficial to all sentient beings. The river spirit rescuing sentient beings everywhere found the door of liberation always being non-malevolent and kind toward all sentient beings. The river spirit heatless pure light found the door of liberation showing all pure and cool roots of goodness. The river spirit universally causing joy found the door of liberation cultivating complete generosity, causing all sentient beings to forever give up stinginess and attachment. The river spirit supreme banner of extensive virtue found the door of liberation being a field of blessings giving joy to all. The river spirit light shining on all worlds found the door of liberation able to cause all defiled beings to be pure, and all those poisoned with anger to become joyful. The river spirit light of oceanic virtues found the door of liberation able to cause all sentient beings to enter the ocean of liberation and always experience complete bliss. At that time the river spirit everywhere producing swift currents, imbued with power from the Buddha, looked over all the river spirits and spoke in verse. Of old the Buddha, for the sake of all beings, cultivated boundless practices of the ocean of truths. Like refreshing rain clearing blazing heat, he extinguishes the heat of beings' afflictions. Buddha, in uncountable past cons, purified the world with the light of his vows, causing the mature to realize enlightenment. This is the realization of universal purifier. With compassion and methods numerous as beings he appears before all, always guiding, clearing away the dirt of afflictions, pure eyes, seeing this, rejoices profoundly. Buddhas speak of wondrous sound, causing all to hear, sentient beings, delighted, have hearts full of joy, causing them to wash away innumerable pains, this is the liberation of everywhere roaring. The Buddha cultivated enlightenment practice to aid sentient beings for innumerable ages. Therefore his light fills the world. The spirit guardian, remembering, is happy. Buddha cultivated practices for the sake of beings. By various means making them mature, purifying the ocean of blessings, removing all pains, heatless, seeing this, rejoices at heart. The gate of generosity is inexhaustible, benefiting all sentient beings. Causing witnesses to have no attachment, this is the enlightenment of universal joy. Buddha cultivated genuine methods of enlightenment. 
developing a boundless ocean of virtues, causing witnesses all to rejoice. This supreme banner happily realizes. He clears away the defilements of beings. Equally compassionate even to the vicious. Therefore acquiring radiance filling all space. Light shining on all worlds sees and rejoices. Buddha is the field of blessings, ocean of virtues, able to cause all to abandon evil and even fulfill great enlightenment, this is the liberation of ocean light. Furthermore, the crop spirit gentle superb. Flavor found the door of liberation bestowing rich. Flavor on all sentient beings, causing them to develop a Buddha body. The crop spirit pure light of seasonal flowers found the door of liberation able to cause all sentient beings to experience great joy and happiness. The crop spirit physical strength courage and health found the door of liberation purifying all realms by means of all round, complete teachings. The crop spirit increasing vitality found the door of liberation seeing the boundless mystical powers compassionately used by the Buddha for edifying demonstrations. The crop spirit everywhere producing roots and fruits found the door of liberation everywhere revealing the Buddha's field of blessings and causing seeds planted there not to spoil. The crop spirit wonderfully adorned. Circular top knot found the door of liberation causing the flower of pure faith of sentient beings everywhere to bloom. The crop spirit moistening pure flowers found the door of liberation compassionately saving sentient beings and causing them to increase in blessings and virtue. The crop spirit developing wonderful fragrance found the door of liberation extensively demonstrating all methods of enlightening practice. The crop spirit liked by all who see found the door of liberation able to cause all sentient beings in the universe to abandon such ills as sloth and anxiety and to become pure in all ways. The crop spirit pure light found the door of liberation observing the good roots of all sentient beings, explaining the truth to them inappropriate ways, bringing joy and fulfillment to the masses. At that time the crop spirit gentle superb flavor, imbued with power from the Buddha, looked over all the crop spirits and said, The Buddha's ocean of unexcelled virtues manifests a lamp which illumines the world, saving and protecting all sentient beings. He gives them all peace, not leaving out one. The Buddha's virtues are boundless. No beings hear of them in vain. He causes them to be free from suffering and always happy, this is what seasonal flowers enters into. The powers of the Buddha are all complete. His array of virtues appears in the world. And all sentient beings are harmonized. To this fact courageous power can witness. The Buddha cultivated an ocean of compassion, his heart always as broad as the whole world. Therefore his spiritual powers are boundless, increasing vitality can see this. Buddha always appears throughout the world, none of his methods are employed in vain, clearing away beings delusions and torments, this is the liberation of universal producer. Buddha is the great ocean of knowledge in the world, emanating pure light which reaches everywhere. Whence is born all great faith and resolution, thus can adorn top knot clearly enter. Buddha observing the world, conceives kind, compassion, appearing in order to aid sentient beings, showing them the supreme way of peace and joy, this is the liberation of pure flowers. The pure practices cultivated by Buddha are fully expounded under the tree of enlightenment. Thus edifying everyone in all quarters, this wonderful fragrance can hear. Buddha, in all worlds, brings freedom from sorrow creating great joy, all potentials and aspirations he purifies, the spirit pleasing understands this. The Buddha appears in Dai world, observes the inclinations of all beings, and matures them by various means. This is the liberation of pure light. Furthermore, the herb spirit auspicious found the door of liberation observing the mentalities of all sentient beings and striving to unify them. The herb spirit sandalwood forest found the door of liberation embracing all sentient beings with light and causing those who see it not to waste the experience. The herb spirit pure light found the door of liberation able to annihilate the afflictions of all sentient beings by pure techniques. The herb 
Spirit Universal Renown found the door of liberation able to increase the boundless ocean of good roots by means of a great reputation. The Herb Spirit Radiant Pores found the door of liberation hurrying to all sites of illness with the banner of great compassion. The Herb Spirit Darkness Destroying Purifier found the door of liberation able to cure all blind sentient beings and cause their eye of wisdom to be clear. The Herb Spirit Roarer found the door of liberation able to expound the verbal teaching of the Buddha explaining the different meanings of all things. The Herb Spirit Banner of Light Outshining the Sun found the door of liberation able to be the advisor. Of all sentient beings, causing all who see to produce roots of goodness. The Herb Spirit Seeing in all directions found the door of liberation of the mind of pure compassion able to make beings give rise to faith and resolve by means of appropriate techniques. The Herb Spirit Everywhere Emanating Majestic Light found the door of liberation causing beings to remember Buddha, thereby eliminating their sicknesses. At that time the Herb Spirit Auspicious, imbued with power from the Buddha, looked over all the Herb Spirits and said. The Buddha's knowledge is inconceivable. He knows the minds of all sentient beings. And by the power of various techniques. Destroys their delusions and infinite pains. The great hero's skills cannot be measured. Nothing he does is ever in vain. Unfailingly causing the suffering of beings to vanish, Sandalwood Forest can understand this. Observe the Buddha's teaching like so, he practiced for innumerable eons and has no attachment to anything, this is the entry of pure light. A Buddha is hard to meet, in a million ages, if any can see one or hear one's name, it will unfailingly bring benefit. This is the understanding of universal renown. Each of the Buddha's hair pours. Emits light annulling distress. Causing wordly afflictions to end. This is the entry of radiant pores. All sentient beings are blinded by ignorance. With an infinite variety of miseries from. Deluded acts, Buddha clears it all away and opens the. Radiance of wisdom, this darkness breaker can see. One tone of the Buddha has no limiting measure, it can open up the ocean of all teachings so that all who hear can comprehend, this is the liberation of great sound. See how Buddha's knowledge is inconceivable, appearing in all realms he saves beings there, able to make those who see follow his teaching, this outshining the sun deeply understands. Buddha's ocean of compassionate means is produced to help the world, opening the right path wide to show beings. This seeing in all directions can comprehend. Buddha emits great light all around illumining all in the ten directions. Causing virtue to grow as the Buddha's remembered, this is the liberation door of majestic light. Furthermore, the forest spirit spreading flowers like clouds found the door of liberation of the repository of the vast, boundless sea of knowledge. The forest spirit outstanding trunk unfolding light found the door of liberation of great cultivation and universal purification. The forest spirit bearing branches emitting radiant light found the door of liberation increasing the growth of all sorts of sprouts of pure faith. The forest spirit auspicious pure leaves found the door of liberation arrayed with all pure virtues. The forest spirit draped flame treasury found the door of liberation of universal wisdom always viewing the entire cosmos. The forest spirit. Pure rays of light found the door of liberation knowing the ocean of all sentient beings activities and producing and spreading clouds of teaching. The forest spirit pleasant thunder found the door of liberation enduring all unpleasant sounds and producing pure sounds. The forest spirit light and fragrance all pervading found the door of liberation showing the vast realm of practices cultivated and mastered in the past. The forest spirit subtle light shining far found the door of liberation benefiting the world by means of all virtuous qualities. The forest spirit flowers and fruits savoring of light found the door of liberation able to cause all to see the Buddha appearing in the world, to always remember with respect and never forget, and adorn the mind of virtues. At that time the forest spirit spreading flowers, like clouds, imbued with power from the Buddha looked over all the forest spirits and said. In the past Buddha cultivated enlightening practices, his virtue and wisdom are thoroughly complete, he has all powers fully in command, emitting great light, he appears in the world. The aspects of his compassion are as infinite as beings, 
Buddha purified them all in eons past, and therefore is able to bring aid to the world. This is the understanding of outstanding trunk. Once sentient beings see the Buddha, he'll plunge them into the ocean of faith, showing to all the enlightening way, this is the liberation of wonderful branches. The virtues amassed in a single pore could not be all told of in an ocean of cons, the Buddha's techniques are inconceivable, pure leaves can understand this teaching. I recall the Buddha in the past made offerings to infinite numbers of Buddhas, his knowledge gradually becoming clearer with each, this is what store of flames understands. The ocean of actions of all sentient beings. The Buddha knows in an instant of thought. Such vast unhindered knowledge. Beautiful adornments can begin to realize. Always intoning the Buddha's serene, sublime. Sound produces incomparable joy everywhere, causing all to awaken according to their understanding and inclination, this is the principle of thunder sounds. Practice. The Buddha shows great mystic powers all throughout the ten directions. Causing all his past deeds to be seen, this is where all pervading light and fragrance enters. Sentient beings are dishonest and don't practice virtue. Lost and deluded, they sink and flow in birth and death. For them he clearly opens the paths of knowledge. This is seen by subtle light. Buddha, for the sake of beings blocked by habits, appears in the world after millions of eons, causing them to see always for the rest of time. This is observed by savor of light. Continued, E.